Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to Catherine's Plates, where it's simple, easy, and delicious in my kitchen. This morning, I'm going to show you how to make home-style breakfast pork chops. It's so easy. It's going to have a delicious seasoning blend, and I'm going to show you how to make that with just simple ingredients out of your pantry. And then we've got some pork chops, and I'll go over those with you. Just some oil, some butter, and then you just need a nice skillet. Okay. We're gonna go ahead and start. I'm gonna show you how to make the seasoning blend first because you can make this ahead of time, but also you wanna let it sit on your pork chops for about 10 minutes. And that will give you time to heat up your oil and get other things ready because these are gonna be really quick to make. And you know, instead of having sausage or bacon in the morning, fry you up some pork chops. Let's go ahead and build our seasoning blend. One tablespoon of minced onion one tablespoon of garlic powder, one tablespoon of paprika, one teaspoon of black pepper, half a teaspoon of salt, one teaspoon of cayenne pepper. We're gonna whisk these all together in a small bowl. Okay, let's take a look at these pork chops. Now, the difference between a breakfast pork chop and just a regular pork chop, these are very thin, so they'll cook pretty quickly. You don't want to be standing over the stove all morning, you know, making a pork chop. So they are bone in, which adds a delicious flavor to the pork chop to begin with. I'm just going to lay these on my cutting board. I have three of them here. Okay, I'm going to take that delicious seasoning blend. It smells so delicious. Now, what's great about this seasoning blend is you can adjust any of the seasonings that are in here. Now, if you don't want it too spicy hot, then you can lessen that cayenne pepper or just take it out altogether and add some more paprika, whatever you want to do. So I'm just going to take some, sprinkle it on the pork chops here on one side. You got plenty of seasoning here for this, so sprinkle it liberally then I'm just going to pat it in you can make a whole bunch of this you know quadruple the amounts and then put it in an airtight container and then you can have it for anything you want to use it for it's a really delicious seasoning blend I'm going to flip them over and do the other side We're gonna let this sit until we get our oil and butter heated up in our skillet. So let's go over there and take care of that while I wash my hands. Over a medium high heat, I've got a large skillet. No, I'm using a cast iron skillet, but you can use any skillet that you want. We're gonna heat up about a couple tablespoons of oil. That's one, that's two, and I'm probably gonna do three. I'm gonna add one tablespoon of butter, probably one more. You wanna make sure that your butter and oil get really hot. The butter will be melted and you want it really sizzling here because that'll give it a nice crust to our pork chops. These are gonna cook pretty fast. If you have biscuits that you wanna place in the oven like I'm gonna do, then you wanna go ahead and get those started. I'm making these grams right here. These are a sweet Hawaiian flavor, so those would be really good. I just sprinkled a little bit of seasoning in the pan here and just see what it's doing. You can see that it's sizzled. So I'm gonna place my pork chops in. All right, you hear that sizzle? Get the other one in. cook about two to three minutes on this side. 
Now notice that we did not dredge these in flour because these are breakfast chops and we're not going to have a gravy or anything like that with these here. We're just looking to get a nice sear on the back sides of these. Do you see that? Yeah. You know, so instead of cooking up your bacon or sausage, put your thin cut pork chops in here. Woo, look at that. Beautiful. I'm going to place a lid on it, just a smaller lid than your pot. And we're going to flatten down the pork chops there. There we go. It'll kind of steam and get nice and tender. I'm going to go ahead and move the lid. <laughs> oh, yeah. Those look good. You're going to place them on a plate, and then you're going to cook any other batches that you have left to cook. All right, I'm going to steam it for the two minutes. Alright, I'm going to show you how we're going to plate those up. Ooh, don't those look delicious. There we go. There's my pork chop, two eggs, and some biscuits with butter and honey. Wonderful breakfast. Let's go in. Ooh, let's put some egg with it. There we go. My bite. Mm. Mm. I love the flavorings in the pork chops. It almost tastes like sausage. <laughs> That's how seasoned that is. It's really good. Nice and tender. I like how thin it is. It cooks so fast. Mm. Pair it up with your favorite eggs, biscuits, bread, whatever you have. All right, y'all, give me a thumbs up on this one. If you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button down below and that bell notification. And make sure you comment down below. And guys, I will see you on the next episode.